Happy Friday. I've got a clean M5, uh, a fully clean M5. The last time I did this, I didn't have time to get to exhaust tires or wheels, and now they're done and looking good. Sunday, if I'm in the mood, there's a, a great event kind of downtown. It's called Bimmers on the Bay, hosted by the CCA. That rhymed. And I went two, two years ago, three years ago now, probably, way back in 19, and it was that it was then called the Jack Cavanaugh Clean Car Show, and they had judges and went through everything, and they were incredibly thorough. They were inspecting door jams, which I lost points for. I had some dirt in the door jams, God forbid. Uh, it's not that anymore. Thankfully, no more actual judges. It's just going to be like a people's choice thing and just a bunch of cool BMWs downtown. It's Spanish, Spanish landing. It's across from the airport, something like that. So we'll see if we get to that. E60's clean and hanging out. Got some work done on Nate's car today. Both unicorn eggs are in. Changed out the rear bushing. Didn't have time to get the diff installed. That'll be Monday. Diff and drive shaft um, are about ready to go. And then we come down here to carbon. I removed the bank one um, Vanos adjustment unit today. So we're even with both of them removed. And I uh, ordered all the parts. The seal kit from Bison Systems and the crush washers and new valve cover gaskets and the grommets for that and all that sort of stuff. Uh, so when that gets in, I'll actually go through and change all the seals and stuff. If I do this again, I would like to do an actual DIY on it. That would be a really comprehensive, probably a super long video, but a good one to have out there. So uh, that takes us again over to the Black 540. Transmission, I think installation was complete yesterday. Today it's full of fluid. We had to order an additional five quarts. The thing holds like nine when it's fully drained like that. Uh, so new seal in there, obviously, the whole whole service kit. So then the next week's going to be wheel carriers. This rotor took forever to get off. It was totally seized on the hub. We're going to take a wire wheel to that. Um, a little bit stressed about having to remove six ball joints, three from each carrier, with the intent of reusing them. That usually doesn't go very well, uh, just because the boots get chewed up from the tool. So we'll try putting some heat and some penetrating oil in there and see where we can get with that. Hopefully not destroy them. A uh, clean, brand new wheel carrier is a beautiful thing, though. Look at that. We're replacing them because where the tie rods go in, that cup in there is cracked. And I told him it's not really a big deal, but he wants to do it. So, hey, if you're going to pay me to do it, we will do it. Somehow that was the day. Uh, it's kind of all I know. I'm going to run back and shower. And then I think Larissa and I are going to date night it out tonight to Naughty Barrel, uh, kind of a local place, and have a, a mule and a really good burger. I don't know what seasoning they do. It's fantastic. It's not that expensive. Kind of a sports bar place. Nothing fancy. But, but tomorrow's a nice place for dinner, so I'm excited for that. I'm getting out of here. Talk tonight. music for eating some puree chicken. <laughs> it smells like shit, but it must taste good. <laughs> oh. Pet treats never smell oh, good for oh, humans. Oh, 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 they all... Damn. Peanut, can you clean that up for me, honey? Hey. Yeah, I bet he will. Peanut, wait. Take that away. <laughs> yep. He's not above it. Good boy. Well below it, in fact. <laughs>